Yo guys, what's up? Um, I got a couple of cool things for you today. Um, I struck up my 20D East Coast Mesh, and uh, it looks pretty sick. I haven't fully broken it in yet because I haven't really taken any shots, but um, it's pretty nice. Got that nice red, white, and blue. It looks so sick in a goalie head. But um, it's got my usual pattern, just so I can you know compare. I didn't want to switch anything up, so. Uh, it's definitely cool. And instead of re-dying, ah, sorry for the yawn. Instead of re-dying the entire head, I just took a couple markers and uh, filled it in. But the darker color blue didn't quite match up, so you can still kind of tell exactly what the damn dye said. But um, anyway, the mesh itself is super nice. Um, it's got a slightly harder feel than like thrown, but it's not to the point of being hard mesh. It's not even like semi hard, but like, well, yeah, I guess it is. Um, it's real nice. Uh, I like it, the feel of it. You know, the ball doesn't rattle around in the pocket when you're going and like, you know, cradling. It doesn't rattle around. It's just super, super nice. A lot of hold, just straight out of the, just the, um, you know, wax infusion. It's really nice. Um, it has a real nice thick seeming weave to the mesh itself and look at how thick that is it's almost like a double weave mesh so it's really cool um, I don't know if that comes from his uh, you know wax infusion process or if uh, whoever he gets the mesh through it's just naturally that, that thick uh, it's, it's really nice um, got the top string everything's normal you know, the usual, because I don't really, you know, like the fry top, and you know, I just don't like how it looks. A lot of people think it's cool, but if you do a top string right, you don't need a triangle, so. Um, otherwise, um, I got some East Coast 20 Diamond Breast Cancer Awareness Mesh, and that was to compare, you know, the, um, East Coast goalie to East Coast shorty. Um, just for comparison reasons, if it's similar feel to the mesh, similar, you know, just to check, you know. So I know goalies, even though the, the sheet of mesh is bigger, sometimes in the, you know, waxing process, they don't know quite how much wax to use and stuff like that. So I just want to find out, you know, if there's any differences. Um, just basic comparison reasons, nothing. You know, I'm not going to go and bash the mesh because I already know it's good. I had the 12 diamond, and I personally hate 12 diamond always, but East Coast kind of almost made me think about keeping it in my head, which is just completely weird. I, I had to check my head for a fever and like swear I was getting sick because I actually almost thought of keeping 12 diamond. But um, anyway. I'm going to probably put that breast cancer awareness in uh, my Evo X6 because it's pretty much my favorite. Um, I've got you know, some pink, some white. Um, I just pre-measured all that. so um, It's going to be a regular top string because I, again, don't like triangles. It looks stupid to me. So That's just personal preference. So um, another deal I, uh, I made, one was for a goalie chest pad. Um, that was with Alex, I believe. Um, he's getting my uh, Warrior chest protector that I said I, uh, I got in college. I didn't wear it very often because it, it just didn't fit me right. So um, my other deal was um, I, I finally did trade away my Nas, which, I mean, I for the longest time I, I didn't necessarily want to do it because I really like the head but um, anyway I did I got a blade pro instead it's not bad um, this isn't his original stringing he had a U in here um, sidewall pattern was a little different I uh, threw around with it didn't like the feel so I wanted to make sure that it was the pocket not the head so I um, I kind of went and redid the sidewalls, took all the shooters out, and kind of changed it up a little bit. So, 
that's the pocket I got in it. It's kind of a boat. It's not the most defined, but you know what? It works for me. So you guys know I can do defined pockets when I want. It's just this is just for me. You know, I can push it up all I want, and it's gonna be a little more defined if I push it up there. But I think I might take out this bottom one, and it'll probably stay up a little higher if I do that. So um, the thing is, either way, I still like the feel, so I might just say screw it and keep it. Um, the thing I did notice, it's not offset at all. Um, very stiff, rigid at the bottom. You know, a little bit more flex to the top. You know, allows a little more torquing near the top. And um, it's not not bad. It's not a bad head, but um, I've really gotten used to the offset heads, so I may or may not be trading that one soon. Um, I may keep it around just for a little while, just to. Uh, find out if it's just, you know, preliminary things, but, sorry, yawning, <laughs> um, anyway, I, uh, no, just woke up, so that's what, or not just woke up, but I've been up for a few hours, but, uh, no, that's just the waking up process, it takes me like half a day to wake up, but, uh, anyway, back to the head, um, yeah, I traded away my nose, this head shape is, very strange because um, it's just so high with the, the flare that it almost forces you to want to have a high pocket in it it's weird but uh like a mid to mid high um, but yeah it's it is cool and now I can honestly say that I've owned a blade even though it's not the OG it's a family member of the blade but um, either way I, I think I may eventually trade it. Um, don't go watching the video and just start like loading up the comments with uh, you know trade offers just yet. Um, but uh, well, screw it. Yeah. Uh, if you if you are interested, let me know. Um, I'll see what type of deals I can come up with and uh, see what I can get. I would rather get like a um, like a preferably college legal head. Um, I don't mean like the X versions, I mean like college only. Because being a goalie, um, it, I don't mind the wider heads. I know a lot of people don't like them. But uh, I don't mind. Uh, as long as they're in good condition. Because this one, very minor scoopies, a couple ball marks that'll just wash off anyway, so it's not that big a deal. Otherwise it seems brand new. There's no warping or anything to it. So. Um, yeah, just comment what you got and I'll see what I can do. Alright, talk to you guys later.